Today I'm going to show you how to set up a file structure to manage all of your photos. I'm going to be demoing it on a Mac, but this can be done on a PC as well. There may just be some different keyboard shortcuts or slightly different pathways to get to where you want to put your images. But the overall idea should be the same and you should be able to implement this either way. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the finder on my Mac, which is this little blue happy face down here. When I click on that, it opens up a new finder window. And this finder window on the PC would be sort of your, your um, file explorer. I'm going to choose the pictures folder to put my pictures into. And I'm going to come up here and I'm going to say new folder. And I can do new folder from the file menu up here, or I could use shift command N, or I could even right click in this and create it. I'm going to say new folder for now. It creates a new folder called Untitled, and it's highlighted and ready to go. And I'm going to name it Photo 180 Main. And so that's my main folder that I'm going to keep all my Photo 180 um, information or photos in. And then I want to create a folder inside of that. So I'm going to hit Shift-Command-N, and it creates that new folder. And this one I'm going to name in a very particular way so that it makes it easier for me to sort these folders and to find what I'm looking for. And the naming convention I'm going to use is the date, year first, so 2022, and then the month, 02, and then the date that it was shot, 06. And then I'm going to put a dash, and I'm going to put a very brief descriptor after this so that I remember what's in this folder so that I can get to it quickly if I need to. So for this one, I'm going to put LR for Lightroom Demo. And I'm going to hit Return, and that folder is created. And so we now have in our Pictures folder our Photo 180 main folder and then our Lightroom Demo. We're ready to put our card into the card reader. And mine is a Canon camera, and so EOS Digital will show up. And inside of that will be all my images. What I like to do, just to make it a little easier, is open a new Finder window. And I'll sort of move it out of the way. And then I can go into my EOS card and see what my folder structure is in there. There's a folder that says DCIM, and that holds all my images. And then there's a miscellaneous. That's just something that the camera creates to manage itself. So if I go into my DCIM folder, I can see that I have um, 100 EOS 5D. So these were shot on, on a 5D. Um, and then I have some other files that, again, the camera has created in order to sort of manage everything. So I'm going to go into the 100 folder. And there you can see all of my images. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit Command A and select all my images. And then I'm just going to drag them up into this folder here and it will copy them over one by one into this folder. While it's doing this, I'm going to talk about if we had more than one photo shoot inside of that folder, I could create another folder and I could copy those images into that. Now I copy all of the images because I find it much easier to manage all of these and edit out the ones that I don't want once I'm in Lightroom and uh, not here in the Finder. So once those are all copied over, I can eject my, my memory card, and I now have my folder full of images, and I'm ready to go.